setback for Kansas City Public Schools that will impact several other metro school systems. Now, the Missouri Supreme Court upheld a student transfer law today. Jenna Hatchard is live at the district's headquarters where a passionate superintendent spoke just 45 minutes ago. Jenna? That's right. They said they're disappointed, but not surprised. They know two things here about this ruling. The first is that the law will allow students to transfer out of the Kansas City Public School District. It will also force the district to foot the bill for all of those students who do want to transfer. So the district still doesn't know at this point how much they will be required to pay and how many students really are looking to transfer here. So right now, there are about 16,000 students in the district, and the district estimates that it would cost at least 10000 per student to transfer. Now, the law has already been in place in St. Louis where thousands of students have fled to neighboring school districts, putting a real financial strain on the city schools. Today, Superintendent Dr. Green says he fears the transfer law would be detrimental to the district and to the city. This ruling, along with the inadequate transfer law, has the potential to rip that away from thousands of urban students. This flies in the face of our community's crystal clear desire for stable neighborhoods and stable schools. That stability, that important ingredient Well, under the Department of Education guidelines, the transfer law, it could take um, effect as early as the 2014 school year, but the district still has to flesh out those details with the Missouri Department of Education. Reporting live from the Department of Education here in downtown Kansas City, Jenna Hanchard, 41 Action News.